Bills defensive end Cameron Hayward was fined by the NFL for wearing eye black honoring his father, former NFL fullback Craig Ironhead Hayward. He tweeted the following. God fine for honoring my dad who bravely fought cancer on my eye black. Hashtag never give up. Hashtag cancer sucks. Hayward wrote the words iron and head under his eyes, which resulted in the $5,787 fine. Stephen A., this was a tough one. Whose side are you on? <clears throat> well, I'm on Cameron Hayward's side, um, which is tough for me because I believe there must be order. Mm -hmm. That rules and regulations are exactly what they are. And obviously, the NFL's uniform policy is not to be compromised nor negotiated. I do understand that part. So Cameron Haywood had to know that. Um, and in honoring his dad, who obviously passed away from cancer, uh, that's something that he's very sensitive to, and he wanted to honor him in his own way. Um, obviously, anybody who's been around people who have suffered from cancer and had to witness that, it hits folks in different ways. Yeah. You know, as my mother has her battles, it hits me in different ways, to be quite honest with you. Um, but the rules are the rules. Here's why, however, I side with Cameron Hayward. The NFL also has it pertains to folks' communication with the media. I saw them make adjustments and modifications when it came to Marshawn Lynch. I saw Marshawn Lynch walk up on Super Bowl week and sit there and say, I'm just here so I don't get fined 29 times. I saw him go the next day, and Lord knows how many times he said, you know why I'm here. You know why I'm here. Not only did he not really honor their policy, he flagrantly violated during the biggest week of the NFL season. And the NFL said nothing initially. Then they said they were going to find him $75,000. He appealed it, went to talk to them, and they said, you know what? We'll take away the fine. Just don't do it again. Mm -hmm. And now... This dude's a spokesperson. I, I, I was, is it Pepsi? I'm not sure. I, I think it is. He's got a couple so of commercials. Of He's got a couple of commercials. We see him all over the yeah. place. You know, and suddenly, uh, suddenly he can talk. Suddenly it's all right. So what I'm saying is as resolute as the NFL wants to come across as being very rigid in terms of its policies it wants to enforce, clearly they're willing to adjust and modify when they who flagrantly disregarded your rules and regulations. His father for cancer awareness. His father did die of cancer. What are you trying to say? He has to wear pink? Is that what you're saying? I, 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 I'm not saying he shouldn't do it. I'm not saying that he should dishonor it. All I'm saying is I see hypocrisy there on the part yeah, of the but NFL. That's kind of an apple and an orange. Yes, it is. Marshawn did jump through a loophole. He, he sort of barely fulfilled his media obligation. He, he actually went and he did speak, so he had some ground to stand on there. Okay. Look, on, on this issue, as always, I'm with the National Football League. And I'm with you. You, you said it up front. You, you have to have order. You, you can't compromise or negotiate the, the uniform code. I guess if... In this case, if, if Cameron wanted to wear a T-shirt, uh, like an undershirt, in honor of his father, that would be okay. But all the outward, everything you can see on TV, you can't compromise. And this is no offense to Cameron Hayward. Mm -hmm. We all have fought with, with loved ones with cancer. Yep. My little sister, I call, still call her my little sister, is fighting stage four breast cancer. And it tears me apart. So I empathize and I sympathize with, with what Cameron is going through here. But... You, you can't open, as I always say, that Pandora's box because mm -hmm. next week somebody else would come and say, okay, I want to honor my, my uncle that I lost to cancer by wearing an armband. And they'd say, well, it was only, you know, it's, it's only your uncle. Well, yeah, but I love my uncle as much as even more than I love my father, what, whatever. Yeah. And then, then you have to start taking it case by case and it just becomes unwinnable for the National Football League. So they have to have zero tolerance right. you know you just can't well stop. I, I don't disagree with you all i'm saying is just like you sat up there and said okay marshawn don't do it again yeah you can rescind the fine to cameron haywood for five thousand seven hundred eighty seven dollars. i hate to see him get fined i'm just saying you know, like you can sit there and go like this okay we're gonna take away the fine 
Just don't do it again. Okay, I'm, yeah. I'm with that. You could do, I'm that, with that's you a good on resolution. That too. You could do that, just that's like fair. it did for yeah. Marshawn yeah. Lynch. And by the way, they're not saying you can't honor your father on right. Twitter or on the team that's website right. no. or speak wherever. I get you want what you're speak. saying. Then it becomes hard yeah. to regulate right. the uniform. It's fine. Just do, just do the same thing you did for Marshawn Lynch. Yep. Guess right. what, guys? It's Thursday, and we got a game tonight.